Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party. <gasps> wow. And welcome to the Enderman Farm. It is done. I may make a few more tweaks, but oh, it's, it's kind of hard for you to see it all. Although this should stand out a little bit. I have no lighting up on there. I should go put torches on the outside of this section because it doesn't matter. But, as you will see, come in here, and look, there's already a bunch of ender pearls on the floor. Wow, and it's loud. Turn down the game audio a bit there. Okay, so, look at all the ender pearls. What was that? Dead enderman parts just flying off. And if I want, I push this up, and then they fall down, and they don't die. And then I can come up here and smack them with chicken or whatever. And get get the experience. And they get upset. Um, and then, to make it easier, because you can, you can walk up too close, and they will smack you. If they get upset. I like that. Um... So to make things easier, I made, made a little minecart here that you can roll along and just smack them from remote, from afar. Or, you know, next to the platform, but at least you're consistently spaced. And notice, I have a few levels of experience. This thing works extremely well. Um, at one point I was dumped down to zero levels and it literally took me less than four minutes. It was like three and a half minutes to get up to level 30, which is pretty cool. That works for me. And it's not AFK, so you don't have to feel bad about just sitting there. Um, you're, you're actively doing something. You're killing the guys and picking up their ender pearls. Yeah. Uh, so there's a few of them. I may extend the minecart track go all the way around because as you saw the experience piles up on the ground over here the little orbs let's do this and um, and then you can come up here and just look at them and they all they all come to you because they're jerks and they're a little self-conscious It's weird, between the experience orbs and them, the entities all go transparent sometimes. You probably are seeing it here. It's kind of weird. And you see there's, oh my gosh. And the experience orbs have trouble keeping up. It's, it's kind of crazy. And we've got a few ender pearls. Oops. Um, yeah, more ender pearls than I know what to do with. I set up a little uh, enchanting setup here. Ender chest, of course. Anvil and storage. Still got some leftover materials. I need to figure out what to do. I do like the, um, this is diorite, right? <laughs> I think so. I can't remember. Yeah, it's diorite. I like the smooth diorite and the smooth andesite. So I may do a little pattern here between the two and extend it out for the rest of the bridge because, you know, the bricks are gray and they're kind of uh they're kind of it's kind of boring um but highly functional that was kind of the point uh, yeah let's climb up here a bit um so this is a totally standard enderman farm design the sort of zip crowd style enderman farm took uh, components of pandas build 
and DocM's build. So there's a uh, it's kind of a fall arrester here. So you can see the Endermen slow down when they get to this point because of the vines. And the vines don't grow down any farther because of the buttons. So from the the level where the buttons are, it's a either 43 or 44 block drop. And that's enough to either kill them or leave them with one heart of health. The farm, as you can see, I mostly made it out of snow because snow is cheap. In fact, it's kind of free. And, um, and there's no creepers or ghasts in the end, so there's no harm of it getting blown up. It's kind of perfect building material. It's white, so it contrasts against the void kind of nicely. Uh, so yeah, I built this up as far as was recommended. So I'm only going up to like Y126 here or something like that. Um, this is the top of the farm. And um, lots of pistons, as you can see. And uh, occasionally a guy will get stuck like that. And they're standing actually right next to the tripwire hook itself and not intersecting with the tripwire. So eventually he'll move and get pushed out. Lots of pistons. There's over a thousand iron in the farm, which is kind of crazy. It, it kind of wiped out my iron reserves. So I'm, I'm going to have to spend some time working on that. Um, and yeah, and so this top layer of half slabs up here is to keep them from spawning up on top. The only spots where they can spawn inside here is on the spawning pads at the point where they will get pushed off by the pistons, except again, right next to the tripwire hooks. So this guy, he'll, and I don't think they can teleport up here. Come on, dude. You can move. So, so anyway, um, we're really high up. And a lot of this is over nothing. Or none of this is over nothing, but um, just off that way is the void. So, yeah. One of the more dramatic ways to get down from here is to jump. <gasps> oh, crap. Whoa, whoa. Oh, dear. Oh, that was, that was dumb. Okay, hang on a sec. I'll be back with you in a sec. All right, welcome back. And that was really dumb. I thought I was holding down the shift button, which should have held me at the vines, but that didn't even seem to slow down. Um, or maybe I did. I'll have to go watch the video back. Hopefully all my stuff is still there and good. It would really, really suck to have lost some of my good stuff. Let's see, what do I have all here? There's armor, arrows. Okay, let's put on armor. Chest plate I've got. I have both picks. I have my shovel. You know, it looks like everything's here. Okay, that was really dumb. That was really dumb. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. I'm going to make sure I have everything here. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go put some of this stuff into a chest. Because I don't want to lose it. But I want to show off what I was trying to do. Uh, no, let's take that and put that. Okay. I got real. I was really lucky. Everything's there. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. And the, oh, hang on. The helmet and the boot. Oh, now I'm gonna have to repair my boots, aren't I? <laughs> oh dear. Oh, that's okay. So let's try that again. And not a bad place to be. Oh, careful. Um, I'm I'm at the freaking experience farm so I can play and see how long it'll take me to get back to 80 levels 
Not that it matters. Not that I need that much. I was just playing around to see how far I could take it. Do, 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 do. Okay, here we go. Almost to the top. So what I was trying to do, and what I hopefully do this time, was uh, get caught up in the fall raster. And, uh, yeah, okay, shift key this time. I okay, get caught up in the fall raster. And, uh, and then uh, do this. Oh, okay, hang on a second. Okay, I'm going to get this right on camera, I promise. I'll be right back. If I can get out of my house. Hang on. All right. Yeah, I have a few powered rails here. <laughs> uh, it seems a bit obnoxious, but um, it, it works. And I had, I had the resources to do it. Okay. Did my stuff make it down? Or what little of it I had? Oh, here, okay. XP over here. Here's all my blocks and stuff. Oh, wow. So the food is gone. All right. Let's try this again. So what I did that time, what I did wrong that time was uh, as I fell I, I tried to move myself closer to the wall to make sure I hit the oh there's some of my experience okay um, these these bands here uh, are big enough for me but not big enough for the endermen keeps them falling straight down and uh, at this point, this is just ridiculous. This is me being insane, but I really want to do this on camera because I ended up doing it accidentally a couple times and it worked out just fine. It was after a certain point, it was the safer way of getting down. So, um, and as I fell that time, I moved closer to the wall to try and make sure I hit the vines. I probably already said that. And as a result, I ended up moving into one of the gaps. So, here we go. Hold down the shift key. Who, huh, okay. I'm done trying that. I, I did manage to do that. Uh, something obviously wasn't working. All right, well, never mind. Oh, I built this, because I have a lot of ender pearls. Uh, Cub fan did a did a thing. This is a little clock here. There's a bit of redstone up on top of there. Redstone torch. Uh, string updates it. Uh, clock runs just long enough to spit out 16 ender pearls, and then uh, the torch burns out, and then it shuts off. Pretty clever. All right. Okay. Well, let's go get my stuff. It's in the chest there in the end. I'll have to replace a few things. I'm going to stop trying to show off. Because obviously it's just getting me killed. So I'm going to go back, get my stuff. Um, build up a few levels. And I will call this an episode. I think, uh, I think I'm think i going to have a few things. Obviously I'm behind on publishing. This is, as I said, episode 8. I just uploaded episode 2 today. Uh, so I'm six, uh, let's call it five episodes behind, um, which is no good. Um, been a little bit busy with stuff and things. Um, and, uh, but I have a weekend, I have a bachelor weekend. My wife is out of town. She's up in San Luis Obispo visiting friends. So that's, uh. So I have a I have a quiet weekend of myself. I have a few things that I have to get done, but uh, I have a few things in game here that I want to get done as well. So, uh, 
completing this. I haven't recorded anything in a couple weeks because this was kind of a full-time thing for a while. Oh, and of course, the whole thing's covered in glass and uh, has water running down. Um, this whole bottom layer. It's all two blocks tall here, so the Enderman can't come out. Do I have stuff here? There's some stuff. Yeah, the dirt blocks survived. Some torches. Yeah. Nothing irreplaceable. No torches. Torches and dirt. Okay. That's a fine. All my armor and stuff is over there. Cool. Um, and I have spare food. Actually, I think I put... Yeah. I, I'm, I'm doing fine. Uh, yeah. So... So I got a few things that I plan to get done this weekend. I will record them and get them uploaded and posted kind of as quickly as I can. Um, yeah, so you'll see, you'll see what those are. I'm not going to spoil anything here, uh, but I, I think it'll be fun. It's stuff I've been meaning to do. Um, and uh, as I said, playing on the server gives you, or gives me at least, a sense of urgency and competition that I didn't really, never really experienced in Minecraft before. So that's kind of, that's kind of interesting. Um, so, so these are on my list of things that I need to get done as soon as possible. Um, I got all the essentials here, right? What am I missing? Uh, some cobble, which I don't have here. I'm gonna bring this wool back with me. Got more food. Um, torches, bucket of water, and the pearls. Yeah, I'm pretty set. All right, so let's uh, let's gather up some of these guys and get back to my level so I can repair my boots. Well, they're not too bad. Oh, yeah, you guys are upset now. You're about to be dead. Okay. So, anyway. Um, so, we're going to take care of a few things that have been brewing. And, uh, yeah, so I'll record them, and I think they will be cool. So, thank you for watching. And uh, if you want, um, I'll post links to videos on the tutorials on building an enderman farm like this if it's something you're interested in um it's pretty straightforward i decided while i started building this doc um and the zipgrat guys posted a different sort of enderman farm which um was is much more low resource um and basically uses the endermites as a uh, the the mechanic of the Endermen hating the Endermites, and uh, the patch notes for 181 say that they're going to fix that, but um, uh, it hasn't changed in the pre-releases. So, or uh, I guess it's, it's wrong to say that the patch notes say they're going to fix that, but they they said basically that the Endermen would no longer be uh, hostile to the Endermites, which would would sort of nerf that style farm but it was really really clever and low low material low cost farm um doesn't require all the pistons and and tripwire hooks and string and all that so um had i seen that and before i started building this i i might have built that farm uh but then I was part way through this and I could have changed my mind. But um but thinking that they were gonna remove it in 181, I didn't want to render that style farm useless. So uh, I didn't. I, I continued building the old style farm. This is pretty darn fast. Um and maybe to play I will I don't know. It it might be interesting to go ahead and still build one of those farms. Um, maybe I'll do it uh, the off the other side of the island or something like that. 
uh, just because it might be it might still be kind of cool um, certainly uh, certainly uh, could be it certainly be fun to build interesting to see if it's um, faster or anything than this because this is I mean look at this I'm already at 24 levels and um, and I've just been jabbering away trying to wrap up the video so this thing's pretty fast so um, anyway I think that will be it um, thank you for watching I will see you let me get some speed on here Woohoo! bounce there we go um, yeah, so anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. Um, I will see you next time. All right, bye.